Hello my croutons! Today I will be showing you how to break away from boxy interiors and start creating some eye-catching maps. Let's get started. Now, imagine this. You're going about creating an indoor map for, let's say, a village. You make a box, then another box, and then you put things in the boxes. Now, this is all wrong. The idea is there, but you're making it too simple. Most homes aren't just box, box, box. Each area should have a different shape and feel. Make each area special to the thing that goes in there. In this situation, this is the hero's room, and he has just woken up to go on an adventure. How would his room look? Well, first consider how many things are going into the room. If we're going Pokemon style, he would need a TV, a bed, and maybe some plushies. Since we only have a few items, the room can be smaller, maybe a rectangle. Now give it some style. Maybe he has a cutout for the TV to be set in, and maybe he has another little area for his plushies. Now, think about where the house is. Is it in some abandoned village? Then make the house decrepit and fill it with damage, cracks, and torn up furniture. Is it a nice country village? Make the house out of a simple, natural resource like wood or stone and fill the house with fewer electronics. Just remember to keep these things in mind, but also know that you're really making this game for you and for what you would want to play. Consider using these tips, but you don't need to. And with that, my croutons, I'll see you in the next video.